the French representative disregarded fully the daily shelling using mortar shells and rockets by those terrorist groups against Syrian civilians in many cities around Syria, which is the main reason for the displacement of the Syrian citizens. Against this background, Mr. Chairman, I would like to highlight that the delegation stating unfounded allegations against my country are depending on amateur <coughs> bloggers and videos, and among one of them is a very famous British citizen called Elliot Higgins, whose online inputs about the situation in Syria are intensively yet mistakenly adopted by many media outlets as well as governments. According to Wikipedia, and I quote, Elliot Higgins in 2012, when he began blogging the Syrian situation, was an unemployed finance and admin worker who spent his days taking care of his child at home. Higgins analysis of Syrian weapons began as a hobby out of his home in his spare time. Higgins has no background or training in weapons and is entirely self-taught. <clears throat> and he said, before the Arab Spring, I knew no more about weapons than the average Xbox owner. I had no knowledge beyond what I had learned from Arnold Schwarzenegger and Rambo. Yet some member states still depend on such biased and unprofessional sources as Mr. Higgins and others like him. Mr. Chairman, it's worthy for all of us to join efforts in fighting terrorism in Syria before its fire spreads further and burns more innocent humans around the planet. It's also essential to support a political and peaceful Syrian-led solution to the situation in Syria in a way that preserves the sovereignty and territorial integrity of the Syrian Arab Republic. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.